Greetings everyone, the Sonic Rider Legend here, and my Gex 3 playthrough continues whether no one wants to watch classic game playthroughs or not. Oh, there's the last one. That takes care of all the secret uh, challenges in the game. Now I get to we'll get to see what's behind the vault. I've opened the vault before, but I just can't remember exactly uh, what happens when you're able to get to get to open it. Oh yeah, that's right. Change the characters. Huh? Oh, it's where it's where you put the 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 the. the it's the codes to be able to play as different characters. Like I just um, allowed to be able to turn into Rex there. I could play as a different character to defeat uh, Rez as, but I'm going to do it with, with, with just... bonus challenges uh, that uh, with the button presses uh, um, are, are the codes to play as uh, the different uh, characters um, in the game um, even uh, in mission control
Okay, I want to change back to Gex. So what I'm going to do with it here is I'm going to save and then I'm going to go back right back um, into uh, the, uh, the game. Apparently, um, I forgot that the, the button code for the codes from the bonus challenges when completing them are what's used for the vault. I'm going to just be Gex and defeat Rez just because I would feel like it. So this part's going to be around 7 minutes for once because I apparently ended up running into a situation of trying to switch back to Gex when I was practicing uh, for refreshing my memory on how the 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 vault uh, um the machine behind the vault is all about so uh, to just hold on uh, and i'll get back to uh, another video uh, with uh, um with gex uh, back to being the one playable here